What's up everybody kid and right here? So, the third major version of the Huawei's Harmony operating system aka 3.0 is all set to release in September this year. Although it's delayed from the schedule, but now the stable version of the OS is all set to release along with the Huawei Mate 50 series and the Huawei Mate 50 series will be the first smartphone to pack the version out of the box. And yeah, this will be some of the significant update ever. Like according to the latest information, the new version polishes the UI and improves performance. While well, talking about performance particularly, the 3.0 version will be 20-30% to faster and smoother than the version 2.0 and at the same time, it will not bring major changes to the UI and the look and the feel of the OS. But it is promised that the logic of instruction and experience will be improved. Particularly, attention will be on the stability and the optimization of work as well as improving of the performance of the system. So yeah, it will be some of the major upgrade ever. Now moving to the second news, we all know the situation between Russia and Ukraine. Well, Russia started conflict with the Ukraine and as a result though, all the British nations stopped doing business with Russia. Particularly if we talk about the smartphone businesses, every major brand cuts off Russia from their list. Only Huawei was left who were doing business with Russia. And today, Huawei did a smart move to maintain its relationship with the United States due to the current circumstances. Well, Huawei also joined the boycott of Russia. Well, Huawei stopped the supply of its smartphones to Russian market, believing that doing business here in the current situation is extremely risky. Now, Huawei intends to close its offices altogether in country and one person with the knowledge of the matter says that the company has stopped taking orders and is preparing to close its corporate offices in Russia, which deals with the telecommunications and network equipment. The Chinese employees of the Russian office and the part of the Russian specialist will leave the territory of Russia and the rest will be on vacation. In fact, Huawei stopped the conclusion of new contracts with the Russian telecom operators for the supply of network and saver equipment. So, why Huawei did that? Like all of us were wondering that, China is supporting Russia. But look, Huawei is already in trouble due to the US sanctions and if again Huawei started supporting Russia, they might lose all the hopes to even survive. And it's being saying that, the US president is happy with this move of Huawei. And look, I'm totally against fights and conflicts. And I'm not even targeting any country here. I'm just telling you guys here to let you know that why Huawei stopped their supplies to Russia only to save their business. So, what do you think? Huawei did a good move or bad? Well, share your thoughts in the comments down below. And as always, I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace out. Bye -bye.